Hey, what's up you guys? Shardimus Prime here, uh, doing an action figure haul uh, from the Minnesota Nerdin Out Con 2, which I had just appeared at last weekend. I'm going to talk more about that in a second, but I'm going to do an unboxing and I'm going to go ahead and show off some of the things I've gotten from Mexico City Unboxing Toy Convention that I forgot to show off there. And also, I wanted to announce that the next convention I will be appearing at, yes, I'm going to another convention, it will be the Silicon Valley Comic Con uh, this coming weekend, but I'm going to go there just for fun, I'm not going to have a table or anything like that, uh, but there will be another appearance I'll be making at the Salt Lake City Fan X, and I am very, very excited about that. Uh, big thanks to Megalopolis for making this happen, I have like lint flying around here, but yeah, Big thanks to Megalopolis, uh, sponsor of this YouTube channel. Check out Megalopolis.toys, link in the description below, but they're making it happen for me to appear as a guest over at Salt Lake City Fan X. I'm very excited about that. I haven't been to Salt Lake City in a long time, since 2005, so I'm very stoked about that, and I hope to see you over there. Uh, I'll be making more announcements about that in the near future. But uh, first, a couple of things that I forgot to show off for Mexico City. Um, right here, this coffee. I forgot to show off the coffee right there. Uh, big Big thanks uh, to the kiddo that gave me the scorpion, 3 3 quarter inch scorpion. Very sad I forgot to mention that in the video. Uh, I also received a custom ebony maw head sculpt right here. The longer mullet, appropriately screen accurate and everything, so very cool. Uh, I also got the uh, unboxing toy, this is like the mech, the mech pin from Max I got. Looking really, really cool. I also picked up these other pins, I bought these. Uh, I put the Infinity Gauntlet one on my jacket already, but I got the uh, PS4 Spidey pin right there. An awesome looking Autobot pin. Uh, I got this Stormtrooper pin. I don't even have room for all of these on my jacket yet. And then an Avengers Endgame pin right there. I'm going to be wiping my face throughout the video because uh, I just took a shower and I got the mean sweats and it's super hot out here. Uh, the Magios Initiative pin right there. And then the Legend, the Marvel Legends Mexico official pin right there. And then somebody had made these awesome prints. Uh, I'm just about sold out of these. But yeah, uh, this is from uh, Juan uh, pa, uh, Paz PZ of Ray. So that's, I'm going to show, this is how he wrote it on the back right here. So check them out. I want to give them the honorable shout out because I absolutely love these. These are freaking awesome. Look, this is a big time let down Spider Man holding Shard and Miss Prime. That is dope as hell. So thank you so much for these, brother. I sold these in Minnesota as well. Uh, someone had made this incredible patch. A lot of people thought I was selling this and I should make these to sell. This is freaking awesome. I'm going to put this on the right side of my leather jacket so it's going to be right there. It needs to get sewn on there. Oh, it's so freaking sick. Love that one. Uh, someone gave me an old school toy review uh, magazine right over here. I have some shark art I forgot to show off. You can see the Shardimus Prime right there. This is awesome. This variant edition comic with all the Shardimus Prime YouTube videos with big time no letdown in the front. That is hella sick. And then you can fill in the blank with the Shardimus action figure right there. That is incredible. I love that. A big time letdown right here. And then we got Shardimus. Uh, get, looks like he's about to get eaten. Spider Shart is about to get eaten right down there. I'm going through these very quickly because there's so much stuff to show off over here, you guys. And I want to make sure I get, you know, some time, you know, showing off everything just at least a little bit. And I read these while I was at the convention. I like this little, uh, big time letdown panels right there. Looking pretty sweet. Uh, the big time letdown with, uh, more of the, uh, video game suit design and then uh, oh yes I love this sud wave so this is like a sud sound wave combo so the ne the nemesis of the Shardmas Prime bot right there is sud wave from your second biggest fan Robert thank you so much Robert and then we have Cyclops right here looking awesome and then we have amazing spider-man right there with Mary Jane in the background this is also from Robert and then we have Batman and then Sudwave again right there. So yeah, awesome look right there. I love that Sudwave with the hat. This is a beautiful pick right over here from Cat. Thank you so much, Cat. I love this. Tr at Trensa9. So that that's her username right there. Trensa9. And then this is the image right there. I love that Spider Punk with J. Jonah Jameson in the background. And then the Marvel Legends official group made this awesome mock-up right over here. I love it. 
awesome print. So that's everything from Mexico City. I think. I don't think I forgot anything else. Now, oh, and then this little dino thing that was given to me also. I like that little dino right there. So that's pretty cool. It's from Bootleg. So, all right. Minnesota was awesome. The hospitality over there, you guys were very, very kind. Thank you so much. I had a great time. Dave Wheeler picked us up, or picked me up right from the airport. And we went straight into toy hunting. Thank you so much, John, for driving us around all over Minnesota. We drove uh, from Minneapolis over to Rochester and back. And again, the sweats. And uh, man, it was a great time. I had so much fun. First night, we, we chatted. The whole group over there, uh, I gotta give a shout out to the Minnesota Toy, toy Posse. They hooked it up with this awesome sweater, which actually really came in handy big time over there in Minnesota, especially it got really cold on the plane. So thank you so much, you guys. Really, really appreciate it. Really awesome dudes over there, man. You guys are a really cool group to hang out with and, and spend time on the podcast. They also gave me a patch, which I dropped right over here. So throw that on the jacket as well. Very stoked about that. And um, I also got, I'm just trying to find everything. I also got some cool artwork over here. So we've got Nerdin' Out 2 art right there, and then some big, some big time, no let down looking. And then I love this, uh oh, I had a web fluid, I thought that was great too, thank you so much. And then big thanks to Tom and Gouy, and he hooked it up with this awesome print that I absolutely love, look at that, that is gorgeous, that is gorgeous, oh my goodness. Thank you so much. A uh, link to his Instagram uh, in the description below. I'm going to try to remember to do that. And then I got myself a whole bunch of figures over here, man. Um, big thanks to Joe for hooking me up with the, with the Domino. He didn't have to gift me this, but thank you so much, man. I wanted a second Domino, so he gave me that. I also bought uh, from, uh, from Hot Comics uh, the uh, Marvel Legends Black Queen. Uh, the original Hasbro from back in the day, the Hello Week one, I wanted to buy that. I picked that up. I couldn't find it. I misplaced it. Uh, I also picked up, uh, at the at the Nerd Now Con, I picked up Orm, which I desperately needed so I could finish my Trench Warrior. So now I have a complete Trench Warrior, so I'm stoked about that. Big thanks to Graham, patron Graham. Uh, right when I got there, he hooked it up with the Marvel Legends Captain America, which I've already started working on the review for. Uh, the 80 Years Cap, very excited about that. And by the way, bro... The star, the star looks great. I got to see, because there's like a little line in the star, and I was like, oh, the star looks a little funky. He's like, oh, I should have looked for more of them. But, uh, and I'm just a super picky guy with the paint apps. It's, it's how I am, bro. It's not just in the reviews. It's how I am. But uh, we got to see more of these at Walmart. So they had a whole bunch of them at Walmart, and they all had messed up stars. So the one that I got actually was the best looking one that I had ever seen in the store at all. So thank you, again, thank you so much, Graham. Whether it's the star or whatever, I'm very grateful. Thank you so much. Uh, and then while we're at Target, I found this Iron Man, the 80 Years Iron Man. You know, I opened it like almost as soon as I got home. So I picked that up for myself. Uh, big thanks, Sam. Oh my God, Sam, thank you so much, bro. He picked this up for me uh, from Nerdin' Out. Uh, this is New Goblin. I have my Spider-Man movie shelf right down here. And Sandman is the last one I actually really need, so I wanted this one. And thank you so much, Sam, for picking this up for me and giving me this. Sam is one of the few that have been watching this channel all the way since the, from, from the beginning. And Joey B, uh, he drove all the way from South Dakota to hang out and everything. And he's one of the few that's really been watching all the way from the beginning. So it was a trip, the two of them talking, and Joey was tripping out because he's like, wow, I don't really meet many people that have been watching Shardimus just as long as I have. And so that was really awesome to see. Uh, and, and hang out with them, you know, awesome guys, awesome guys, I had a great time. I picked up Lord Zed over at the convention, I needed Lord Zed, and I also got myself a spider hat, because I needed a new baseball hat, and this is like a sporty baseball hat, so I'm stoked about this, I picked this up at a GameStop. Somebody, and then lastly, oh wait, wait, Dave also, Dave Wheeler gave me this, uh, this awesome Far From Home uh, string, drawstring backpack, which I like these a lot. They're great for conventions. And then someone had made a Marvel Legends Cyber. This is uh, this is from Ryan Robinson. Thank you so much, Ryan. This is freaking cool. Look at that. Oh, that's so awesome, man. I dig it. I really like it a lot, man. Thank you so much. 
And he has a whole read-up over here on the back, which I'm not going to read right now, but I have a couple more things to show off. But yeah, man, I had a great time in Minnesota. I'd love to go back again. Uh, we got to see uh, the Mall of America and everything before I left. It, it was a really fun time. Ate some great food. I got some cinnamon popcorn, which I'd never had before in my life. Uh, I gave that to Charlita one. I ate some, but yeah, I gave her the rest of it. And then a couple other things I just want to show off really here, uh, really quick over here. Uh, thanks to Dynamite Comics, they sent me over here uh, the volume one uh, compendium, I guess, of the boys trade paperback, which I still need to see on Amazon. I actually already have these, so I'm probably going to do a Patreon giveaway for this, but I think this is awesome because I have the first nine trade paperbacks, but I definitely want to reread this and take a look at the show. And then Hasbro sent over some San Diego Comic-Con exclusives uh, that I have not reviewed at all. And these are, I know what these are all, all are, but I wanted to show this off over here and ask you what you'd like to see reviewed. These are all of the Star Wars San Diego Comic-Con exclusives. And this one I had actually picked up, oh that looks pretty sweet. We have the Black Series Sith Trooper right there, so I'm curious to know which of these you guys would like to see reviewed. I have Boba Fett right over here. Looking sweet. And then, oh man, I definitely have to open these. Luke Skywalker being my favorite character from Star Wars. And then we have the action figure set of Luke Skywalker. Looking awesome. All three of these in the back. Thank you so much Hasbro for sending these my way. And I really appreciate it. This is a little letter that they sent me. So yeah, very, very cool. So I want to know which of those three you guys want to see reviewed. I have a whole bunch of Marvel Legends to review. So much stuff going on. And man, very grateful for everything you guys have done. I mean, you guys are making these experiences truly amazing. Oh, so much to the point where I can't stop sweating and excitement over here. So, been having a great time, you guys. Thank you so much. It's been a lot of work trying to post videos while I'm gone. Uh, but more reviews to come. You guys may have noticed Stop Motion is already back, so stay tuned for that. Oh yeah, and I also got the Nerdin' Out 2 uh, t-shirt right here. I forgot to mention that as well, which I'm sweating profusely in. It's really hot over here, you guys, in California. But anyway, thank you guys so much, and uh, stay tuned for another review tomorrow, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace!